Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So this is part one of last week's video and this is part two of this week's video. These are the two foam pieces that are already cut out and painted and now I'm just gluing them both together. Next, I'm taking my ruler and my silver sharpie to trace a line down the center and then I'm gonna cut it with my X-Acto knife. So I have these two half moon shapes, but for now I'm working with one and I'm just putting all my toilet paper rolls in place before gluing them to my foam piece. I'm using my silver Sharpie to mark exactly where I need to put the hot glue. This part is the top and this part is the bottom and now I'm just adding more glue to secure the toilet paper rolls. I'm flipping my piece over to add these wood blocks to help stabilize the toilet paper rolls and I already had these wood blocks on hand which I previously painted with my ebony black acrylic paint that I purchased from Michaels. I'm using more of those rectangular mirror tiles that I used in part one, and I will be gluing four mirror tiles to the top and to the bottom of each toilet paper roll. I'm using more of those spoon handles and this part was a little bit time consuming because you have to actually hold the spoon handles into place while the glue dries and as you guys can see I'm placing two spoon handles at the bottom and also two spoon handles at the top. Now I'm gluing five of these acrylic gems right in between the spoon handles. I'm gluing more mirror tiles to the back center of the toilet paper rolls. Now I'm using these circle mirror tiles and I'm gluing them right to the bottom of the rectangular mirror tiles that I glued to the spoon handles. I'm gluing more circle mirror tiles to the front center to fill in the gaps. Once I get done with this step, I'm gonna clean all my mirror tiles off and then I'm gonna add these two LED push lights that I wrapped with my metallic tape that I purchased from Amazon. And then this is how it all turned out. This is a short clip of last week's wall sconces if you have not seen it already. And this is part two, which these turned out unique as well. But comment down below if you like part one or part two better. Mm -hmm. 
I decided to make some candle holders to match with my wall sconces and I'm using those same toilet paper rolls and also the same rectangular mirror tiles. I'm gluing four mirror tiles at the top and bottom of these two toilet paper rolls, but I'm spacing them out a couple inches apart. It should look like this and I'm repeating those same steps for my second toilet paper roll. Now for these two toilet paper rolls, I'm completing the same exact steps, but I'm only gluing the mirror tiles to the top of the toilet paper rolls. I'm gluing two wood blocks to the center of these toilet paper rolls to make it easier for me to glue the toilet paper rolls to the center of my mirrors. Now I'm cleaning all my mirrors off and I'm gluing these candle holders right to the center. I purchased these small acrylic clear gems from Amazon and I'm just gonna put a small amount in the candle holders and then I'm just gonna place these toilet paper rolls right in the inside. If you seen last week's video, then you seen me spray paint these, which the spray paint did overpower the light shining through. It shines through, but only through the bottom, but just very little. And of course I am gonna use these. These fit right inside the toilet paper rolls, but I will not be using the lights. At the last minute, I decided to add more mirror towels. And once I was done with this step, I cleaned everything off did my setup and then I had something that looked like this. I changed my mind and decided to go with that up down pattern for these mirror tiles right here in the front and these turned out absolutely amazing. They look so glam and cute. They don't even look like toilet paper rolls. But tell me what y'all think. Please like, comment and share. And if you're curious to see what else I can create, Hit that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so you don't miss my next video.